It's a sketch comedy podcast show. Thank you for tuning in. Now back to our moderator, Stuart Rice. Now, Allison, uh, this next question is for you. The FBI investigation, please, can you elaborate onto that? Um, there's a lot of questions as to whether or not it's valid or if it's even happening. But can you please speak to the FBI investigation that's happening currently? Yeah, the FBI, they're, they're just doing their job. They're looking into it. They're, they're looking at all sides. And uh, they're, I think they're going to come out and see that um, the allegations are they're false in this case. Margaret, this next question is for you. Uh, there have been rumors of drug use. Can you can you speak to these rumors that are circulating? I mean, I think, you know, rumors are a terrible thing and it's just sort of hearsay. And if you believed everything that you heard on the street, you know, you wouldn't have any faith in anyone. So I, I think you just shouldn't listen to rumors. Allison, this next question goes to you. Um, there have been some serious allegations of child abuse in the household and uh this is a major concern for a lot of americans and i think it's important to address this issue and let the american people know exactly what is going on well let me just say this first and foremost and that is that child abuse is never okay uh, you should never lay a hand on a child it's never okay to cause harm to a minor and, you know, I just think that if people wait to hear the outcome, to find out what investigators, you know, find during their investigation, they'll, they'll see when the truth comes out that, that, that these allegations are false. Margaret, um, there are a lot of charities involved. And a lot of people are concerned that these charities are not actually helping the people that uh, they're supposed to be helping. Um, what, what do you have to say about that? Stuart, that's a great question. And I'm so glad that you brought it up because the charity work is the most important part of, uh, what we do, you know, and it's, it's in no way, uh, controversial. Uh, it's in no way harming anybody. And the absolute 100%, uh, fact is that the goal is to help as many people as possible and um, that there isn't anything, um, you know, questionable going on there. Allison, I, I have to say there is a lot of disturbing video circulating around the internet and on network news that uh, it, it's quite damning in uh, what it was showing. Um, how do you explain what was in that video? Well, Stuart, I know that people, you know, they like to gossip and they like to talk about things and they think that they, they understand more than they do because they saw a video on the internet. But, you know, videos don't always show everything. Sometimes they don't cover all the angles. Sometimes they're a little bit grainy because they were shot from far away on a camera phone or a security camera. You know, you can never really understand what happened in a situation unless you were a part of it. And I I don't think that, you know, these videos that are going around necessarily depict the truth of the matter. Margaret, this next question has to do with religion. There has been a lot of talk of some very occultish type happenings. And I was wondering if maybe you could possibly speak to that. Stuart, you know, I'm, uh, I'm so glad you brought this up as well, because I think every American and everyone is entitled to their religious beliefs, and I respect religion, and I respect uh, I respect what people believe in terms of, you know, their faith and their higher power and all of that. And uh, and I do too. I have my own faith and my own higher power. I think, uh, you know, going back and kind of examining the whole uh, talisman thing is, you know, it's a little cute. Uh, I, I wouldn't say that it's uh, there's any real fact based in it, but um, you know I do 100% respect and and admire people who do have a faith and a higher power, and and I think that you know you should be allowed to practice that faith. Please stay tuned as we pause for a brief moment during this the fourth debate 
in the Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt online fan forums brought to you by Reddit.